Oh, what's up, buds? Back like I never left. Now, today we have a bike from Freebeat. This is their lit bike, and we're going to get into the price and all the breakdowns of this bike and my time using it. So, let's get to it. All right, so let's get to the price. The price for this bike is going to be $1,125 right now. Um, I put the link down in the description below so you guys can click that and see what different deals they got going on because it is slashed out from $1,700. So, you're saved in like $650 right now. So, also, if I get any discount codes, I'll put that in the link down below or whatever promo codes they have going on for you guys. So I'll see what we can do and get that down there for you guys if they have any promo codes. But not just the lit bike, they also have the boom bike, which is a cheaper option of this bike basically. It's $650 and you can do a payment plan on that for $20 a month also. So if you're trying to save even more money, they do have another option. Honestly, that bike is not too much different from this one. Um, it's gonna have a smaller screen and then it will be a little bit lighter. This is like 120, 115 pounds and I think the boom bike is like 65, 75 pounds. Um, but basically almost everything is almost the same in that bike. So if you need to save a little bit more money, you can look at that option for yourself. So when it comes to the size of the bike, the bikes, both bikes actually, they fit basically a yoga mat size. So they should be able to fit on a yoga mat with no problem length wise. Um, it doesn't take up too much room. If you're in a crowded space, you could probably tuck it away somewhere. If you have a bigger space, it's definitely not going to be no problem for you. We are in an apartment. We have it to the side where you see it here and on our couches right here. So it is to the side, but you can roll it as well. It does have wheels and you can roll it into place and roll it back into a corner. So it's very easy to maneuver, even though when you're putting it together, it does feel a little bit heavy. But once you get these wheels on here, you're all set. And speaking of putting it together, it was really simple to put this thing together. I did it by myself. Um, it comes in like all the major parts are put together basically. The frame is already set. All you gotta do is put the seats and the arms and the and the feet on. It was really simple. I think the screws were like, it was like 12, 14 screws max or something like that. And it gave you all the tools that you needed. The only part I will say you might need help with is lifting this up to put on the bottom frame. That thing was heavy, but yeah, I did it myself. But other than that, it was so easy to put together. All right, so right here we have the pedals. The pedals are really uh, simple and easy to do. They have a fastening um, part right here where you could just fasten your foot. You stick your foot in here and you're gonna be good to go. Tighten it up, start riding. Also, the pedals have an auto resist. So when you're doing your classes, you'll be able to click auto resistance and it'll give you like that um, going uphill feel or a loosen up, whatever the instructor's telling you to do. Really cool feature. Um, so you have that option as well with the pedals. I do like that. All right, so right here, um, the seat is a smart sensing seat. So it has a sensor in it. It's like right in the inside. It knows when someone is on the bike and off the bike or when you're lifting up. Um, sometimes the instructor will tell you, you know, lift up and go and pedal standing up on the pedals and it'll know when you're up sitting down and all that stuff. So you do have a smart sensor seat um, with this bike as well. All right, so now we got the screen. The screen can move all around. It's basically 360 if you want it to be. You could just move it around. And they have different um, classes on here. It's not just cycling. You can do stretching, sculpting, and all that stuff. So if you want to be to the side, if you're at the angle you are on screen and you want to work out, then you can do that. If you want to get back to cycling after you're done, after your sculpting workout, hop on, move the screen there, and you're good to go and you're ready to start. So it's nice to have that option, especially with the different classes there. You don't have to be behind the bike to do the classes. You could just move the screen sideways. And on top of that, you can also tilt the screen. You know, if you want to look down at your workout, you're good to go. And it only goes so far down. That's the maximum, you know, level down that you can go. But yeah, you can also tilt it up if you want to as well. All right, so when it comes to the subscription, I was seeing $40 a month. I don't know if you can pay for the full year subscription. Um, 40 might seem a little steep a month, but another thing is you can have multiple people on here from what I've seen. It says you can have 10 accounts, and I'm thinking you can have all 10 accounts on this uh, bike, so they'll be under your subscription. I'm hoping that's what it's like, because when I was testing it out, I want to get the official subscription price, but it said, I made my wife make an account right before we shot this video, and it said that she um, is under my account. So if it does that for all 10, you'll have all those people under there, like Netflix, basically. You know, you make your own profile and you'll all be able to use it. And it's simple, easy to switch. In the bottom left, you'll just click it and then switch whoever's using it and that, and you're good to go. All right, so for adjusting on the different heights that, you know, my wife is five foot and I'm six five, so the adjustment is huge. So all you'll do is you'll grab this right here, pull it out and then lift up and find your adjustment. And it'll snap into place when it's good and ready to go. 
All right, so you can adjust the seat as well to match, you know, normally it tells you go waist high. There's a tutorial video when you start to get your personal setup for your uh, profile account and I'll tell you how to set up for your height and stuff. So all you will have to do is, you know, pull this as well and then lift up and then you'll get the height that you need and you'll be set and go and ready to go. Like I said, it says normally do like waist high, but just do whatever's comfortable for you. Cause when I did waist high, I felt uncomfortable, you know, riding it. And so just find the right adjustment for you. Also, you can adjust how close and far back you want to go. There's a little knob back here. You just twist it and then you can move it, the seat further back or you can get closer. You know, my wife has to be closer, little arms. So we'll, you can go closer and I have long arms, we'll go back. So you can adjust that as well. So there's a lot of adjusting to get, you know, the perfect um, fit for you and you know, how you want it to sit. And another thing you can do, you can add your weights back here if you want to, um, for when you ride and you do your weight exercises, you can just add them back here. So you don't have to go looking for them or get off your bike or stop your workout. You know, you could just reach back and grab these as well. All right. So, um, one thing they do have right in the front, this is how you will adjust the resistance of your pedals. So if you want to make it more uphill battle, really want to push down hard, you just go to the right. And if you want to make it an easy ride, you go to the left. Like I said, they do have auto resistance. You'll tap that on your screen. It'll be right at the bottom of the screen while you're doing your workout. But if not, if you want to adjust it yourself and you feel like the auto resistance is not enough for you, you can always just boost it up too as well. All right, so also there's a plug down here. This is where you connect the power plug. It'll feel like it's a regular screw, but it's not. It's where you will put the plug in. But we're also going to just move it right now. Um, all you do is you go grab it from the back and then just lean it and you can just roll this bad boy wherever you want to go. It's really light. Even though when you pin it together, it seems heavy. It's going to be really light for you to move wherever you want, maneuver it. So I really like that. Um, don't have to be um, nervous to do it. Just watch the screen when you do it. Um, All right, bud. So as you guys can see here, there's this on beat um, thing that lets you know when you're on the beat of the song. I can't hear it right now because I am shooting the video. Your trainer um, will keep you in rhythm and all that stuff. As you can see, there's the auto resistance right here. You can click that on or off. Also, you have the leaderboard, which is my favorite thing because when I'm getting tired, like I am right now, I always look at that leaderboard. And I try to get it more, higher, higher, higher. And it also keeps me from quitting. So it's like when I'm getting like in the 30s or something and I see myself dropping down, I pick it up. So that's another good motivation thing that I like with the leaderboard to see what everyone else was doing. Ah! All right, bud. So that is basically the video. I'm in the middle of a workout, almost done with it. But if you're looking for a bike that you can get, you don't have to spend the big money on the Peloton. I think that's like 2,000, almost 2,500. You can get this for 1,125, or you can get their um, their uh, more budget option, I guess, at I think it's 645, 650. So those are the different options you can get with this bike. This is the free beat a lit bike or you can get the boom bike so those are the two different options you can get you can see this thing is kicking my butt right now but if you're looking for something that won't take up a lot of space you know you can get a nice workout in if you don't want to go to the gym or if you're just starting and you're trying to build up to go to the gym i think this is a good option for you um i like this thing i don't like to work out but i do like this thing so but like i said before i'm gonna put the links down in the description below and any promo codes or anything i get hopefully to get you guys some more money off down in the description so you guys can click that down there but if you guys like this video please like comment subscribe and i see you guys in my next one look out for my highest score i'm gonna be up there top 30 top 30. Yeah.